y'all hear me? I just want to know if you really came to praise God. This is my sixth service in the last few days. I'm tired. Been singing and preaching all weekend long. But I've come to let the enemy know I still gotta pray. I still gotta dance. I still got some worship. I need someone to begin to shout like you lost your mind. Begin to get down and crazy pray.
Come here real quick. Prophesy a word over the people. I know you tired. Just give me a freestyle prophecy and I'm going to let you go. I want to tell somebody that if you would just praise God right now for the miracle that you need. Some of you came in here happy with a burden. But I hear the Lord saying, praise your way out. If you would just praise Him right now, God said, I'll heal you. I'll deliver you. I'll say, you ought to shout right now for your miracle. want you to give God the biggest shout that you know that you need not now but going into 2024 I want an advanced shout it's already done shout we ain't got to wait till the battle was over we can shout right one two three give it to him glory This band will be, look here. This band, somebody say, this band. They ready, but we gotta move on. Come on, give God a hand, praise for Matthew and Gary. Now, sat down like Tyler Perry said. This band will shout till Jesus come back. Do you hear me? We got a whole program, fam. Jay Red, you know, when I host, I gotta keep it moving. People gotta bring me back. I got child support, amen. But God is good. We're going to let the Holy Ghost flow. But right now, this guy is amazing. Somebody say amazing. amazing. Quick shout outs. Apostle Garrison and all the clergy that are in the building are in the house. Clap it up, y'all. Clap it up. Clap it up for all the pastors, all the clergy. Deshaun Little. Come on, y'all. Is in the house. Come on, y'all. Did I say your last? I should have said your last. I'm sorry. Deshaun, I should have just kept it right there. Huh? I'm sorry. That was too personal. I, you know, you're my brother. Anyway. Saying last names. All right, listen. Right now, this guy is amazing. Somebody say amazing. amazing. I, I, I want you to know uh, you guys already, you guys understood the assignment. I said, we're going to treat everybody the same. Because the anointing, look here, God looks at the heart, not the outward appearance. So it don't matter what you're doing on the outside, I want you to understand God knows what's going on the inside. And no matter whether you're white, black, come on, y'all. Latino, how many of y'all know we all God's children? Now, Matthew, he just light-skinned. Amen. I don't know what he is. He just light-skinned. He off the chain. I don't know what he is. That's just a light-skinned anointing on him. But this guy is amazing. I'm going to get out the way. Put your hands together long and strong. Very anointed, very gifted. Jaron Himes. Junior! Come on, give God a hand, pray for this man of God. Come on. Come on, come on. We got the older generation, we got the youth, the millennial. The, come on, y'all, we got the new generation. Come on, y'all. Clap it up for Jaron Hines Jr. 
He's going to bless us real good. Hands lifted all over the room. Love. A word that comes and goes. But few people really know what it means. Is anybody know it? To really love someone. Though the tears may fade away, I'm so glad your love will stay. Because I love you, and you show me, Jesus, what it really means to love. Was that too old for y'all? That was too old. Give me that four. All my life you have been faithful It's all my life you have been so Sing it out So With every breath Come on, yeah Woo! Come on I will sing Of the goodness Can we sing that out one time? Break the music. See you all my life. Right here. All my life you have been faithful. Mm-hmm. Da, da, da. All my life yeah, da, da, da. you have been so, so good. So good. With every breath. Every breath that I Woo. am made. I'm oh. going to sing. Of the goodness of the goodness Woo! of God. Your goodness is running after it's running after me. Woo! Your goodness is running after it's running after me. With my life laid down, I surrender now. I give you everything. Your goodness is running out. It's running out. Woo. Is that B flat? <laughs> we just came just to give God the glory. All the glory. All the glory. I just came just to give God the glory. He has been so good to me. Yes, he's been so good. He's been so good. So good. So very good. He's been so good. So good. He has been so good to me. Woo! We just praise him, but can we worship just a little bit? Okay, I'm getting ready to sing my song, for real. That was B-flat, right? Okay, just real quick, put me in F. Mm. F sharp. Mm. Song says, I'm already loved. I'm already chosen. I know who I am. I know what you've spoken. Ooh. I'm already loved. More than I can imagine. And that is, you know. And the song says, You are Jaira, you are enough. 
You are Jairo. You are enough. And I will be content in every circumstance. Child, you are enough. Oh, y'all know that one too? Y'all know everything. I'm going to sing my song for real. I got an album coming out. Make some noise for an album. It's my first one. I have a conference. It's called Amplify. And we did a, we did a live recording um, a year and a half ago, something like that. And so we're going to finally put that thing out November 3rd, Friday, November 3rd. Um, so I'm going to do one of the bonus tracks on the, on the album. Is that all right? Can y'all get with me? It's a familiar song. I promise you, you'll know it. Let's do it. Everybody clap those. It's okay to stand up. Let's go one time. Everybody clap those. Stand up. Yeah. yeah. Let's go. Song says, "Let the glory of the Lord rise among us. Let the glory of the Lord." Rise among us, let the praises of our King Rise among us, let it rise Yeah Let the glory of the Lord Rise among us, let the glory of the Lord Rise among us, let the praises of our King Rise among us, let it rise Yeah if y'all know it, sing with me. And we say, oh, come on, y'all. Let it ride, yeah. I hear y'all. Let's do it one more time. And we say, oh, oh, let it rise. Clap your hands. Come on, clap, clap. It feels so good in the room tonight, yeah. Let's take it up right here. Let it rise, yeah. Rise among us. Let the glory, let the glory of the Lord. Let it rise, yeah. Rise let the praise of our King. Let it rise, yeah. Rise among us. Let it rise. Let the glory of the Lord. Let it rise, yeah. Rise let the glory of the Lord. Let it rise, yeah. Let the praise of our King. Let the praise of our King. Yeah. Let it rise. Yeah, I sing the old with me, come on, y'all. And we sing. Oh, let it rise. Yeah. Let it rise. Yeah. And we sing. Oh, let it rise. 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 One more time, let it rise. Let it rise. Woo! We have this part of the back end. It goes like this. Let your glory, let it rise. Let your glory, let it rise. Say, let your glory, let it rise. Say, let your glory, let it Say, let your spirit, let it rise. 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 Say, let your power, let it rise. Say, let your power, let it rise. Say, like a bitch, say, let your power. Say let your power come on, y'all. Everybody, clap your hands. Say power, 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 power
To give me a good four, give me the four, give me the four right here. Everybody, clap those hands. That's all right. We're going to go ahead and do the backup. Somebody say, God is good. Hi, Lady Doctor. How you doing? Look here, y'all. I want y'all to know that right now I want to do something real quick. Somebody say, real quick. real quick. Let me do this real quick. Where is Matthew at? Matthew, did, he, did he take a nap? Come here, Matthew. Okay, come here. He said you was tired. Where are your people at? Can your people just come here real quick, real quick, real quick, real quick, fast, fast. All, your, all the BG, uh, BGVs, that's background vocals if y'all don't know it, I'm a singer. Listen, come here, come here. People say I look like Marvin Gaye. Lady Dockery, Lady Dockery, do I look like Marvin Gaye? She, she looked down, okay. She can't lie in church. What's your name? My name's Alan. Clap it up for Alan, what's your name? Nicole. Clap it up for Nicole. Lauren. Lauren, come on. Michaela. Michaela. Davina. And what is it? Davina. D- Davina? How can people find your music? Uh, you can check it out on Instagram. We're actually having a live recording May 24, 2024. Our first album release, so I'm excited about it. So, Instagram. I'm an anointed host. The Lord told me to do this. And you have your first album release, huh? You's a bad man. Light skin anointing. God bless you. 
Where's, where's Jaren? Where's Jaren at? Come here, quick, 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 quick. Come on, Jaren. We got to know about your music, man. I support Bay Area and beyond. I, I look here, I'm from here. Come on now. Come here. Where your people at? Sean, where y'all at? Bring them singers up here. Where them singers at? BGVs, background vocals. I'm a singer, I know this. Come on, come on. Come on, come here, come here, come here. What's your name, sir? You just gonna sing with headphones the whole night, huh? You, you, you bad. Oh, it's a head fan. Oh, oh, look here. Fire shut up in your neck. That's fire! Come on, Jeremiah! There's fire! Shut up in his neck! You need a cooling fan. Jesus! The esophagus. What's your name? Timmy. Timmy? Clap it up for Timmy, y'all. Amber. Oh, that's a beautiful name. Everybody say, hey, Amber. Hey, Amber. I know it's more of them. Y'all didn't come up. Somebody else didn't come. That's okay. I'm going to get them later. Tell them about your music, how we can get your music. Okay. Um, my name is Jaren Heim Jr. Uh, you can get my music anywhere. Um, Apple Music, Spotify, YouTube. Uh, you can go to my website, www.experienceamplify.org. Um, and you'll have all the links and stuff there too as well. Do we support our own? Somebody say support your own. Clap it up for Bishop Dockery, Lady Dockery. Come on, y'all. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, yeah, you know they love you. Oh, look at this. Oh, they love you. Oh, they love you. Clap it up for Mama Girl. Uh-huh, uh-huh. You know I love you. She still give whoopings. Listen. It, with a switch, and she make you pick your own. Ugh. I'm old school. I want you guys right now to get ready, because we heard ensembles, we heard, you know, soloists, we seen Marvin Gaye, but... Y'all ready to hear a choir? I mean, not just any choir, the Sacramento Unity Choir? Come on, y'all. Look, I need y'all to put your hands together long and strong, loud and proud, and show love for Sacramento Unity Choir. Make some noise! Well, I like how choirs get ready. They be like, they, they, they get serious quick. Come on, choir. Now, please, please, man, if you don't come here, tell these people your name. Huey Lovelady. Thank you. Because I always want to say lace, but I'm really. <laughs> Huey is one of Sacramento's gospel legends. We're going to make sure. Come on, I need all over this building. Come on. Huey Lovelady. Come on, I need y'all bigger claps, bigger claps. Somebody say amen. I like to, I like to give people their flowers. Huey is family. He is Sacramento's own and we want to make sure we continue to love on our own from Sacramento to the Bay to Stockton, Modesto, Fresno, wherever you are, this is our area. Somebody say amen. amen. While they're while they're coming, I'm gonna do an A selection. Y'all need to walk fast because I will sing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's that Marvin Gaye coming out. Distant Jesus, distant Jesus is coming back soon. All right, I'll leave that alone. I'm working on that joke. It's called Distant Jesus. You know, distant lover. Y'all missed it. Y'all missed it. Here we. You ready, baby? Y'all clap it up for Sacramento Unity Choir. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Somebody say yeah. yeah. Hey Amen. I would be remiss if I didn't give honor also to, to uh, Bishop Troy Dockery. Can we give it up for him again? I was looking for him. I don't see him. Where is he at? Hey Amen. I love him and I've known him a long time. Thank you for allowing us to come into this space. Hey Amen. Amen. This is unity, but also I have Sac Metro Cat mixed with us. So we just all mixed together, Sacramento. We came to show some love. The song says, Trust Him. Can we turn to your neighbor and say, In all thy ways, acknowledge Him. And He will 
direct your path. Tell him, trust him, trust him. Sister Olivia Williams is going to help me.
That is also on all social media outlets and all Spotify. It's a single that we produce. Hey man, Nikki's coming. We're getting out the way. The blood still works. Touch your neighbor and say, the blood, the blood, the blood. I plead the blood, I plead the blood. Anybody know about pleading the blood? Come on, wave your hand if you know about pleading the blood. Hallelujah! Plead the blood over your family. Plead the blood over your own body. The blood still works. I know because I tried it. I tried it. It still works.
justified and rejuvenated and healed and atoned and worked and worked and worked and had all power, all power, all power, all power, all power and worked and worked. Leave the blood on the man. Leave the blood on the children. Leave the blood. Sacramento unity. Ooh, yeah. Now, y'all know I got that preacher kid in me. I, uh, we got to move on. Oh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, Lord. Yeah, Lord. Yeah, Lord. Mm. Mm, yeah. My God. Oh, we got to move on. Oh, there's so much oil in here. Jesus. Speaking of oil, they selling fish. Immediately. That's how the Holy Spirit works. They're selling fish immediately after service. Danielle's, right? 
Somebody say, Danielle. Holy Ghost, me, we got a different relationship. I said, oil, oh, God. I said, don't forget the fish. Jesus ate fish. But he turned them into fishers of what? Me. Come on, know your Bible. He turned them into fishers of what? And how many of y'all know the blood still works? Come on, y'all, clap it up. Deliverance, salvation, healing is in the blood. Somebody say power. power. Oh, y'all said it with power. I was going to usually have to say it, say it again, but y'all don't have to say it again. Y'all said it good the first time. Y'all did good. Listen, Deshaun, we have to do something that I don't want to do, but I got to obey instructions. We're going to take a 15-minute intermission. I know, I know that oil is real Crisco right now. I know. It's real Crisco right now, but we have to flow because they want you to know there's vendors, there's food, there's bathrooms. Big Mama's, Big Mama's cakes. When I tell you sweet potato pie, make you want to slap your mama, auntie, and your stepdad. You want to slap him anyway. This gives you a reason to do. Huh? Mama Gail, what you think? I don't know why y'all looking at me. I only brought three jokes. I ain't got nothing else to say. 15 minute intermission. Dev, put some music on. Come, I got a question from the audience. Yes. Okay, I'm sorry. Oh, go. Okay, okay, sorry, boss. Okay, okay, I thought you was trying to ask me something, but I was just messing with you, baby. Listen, we're going to take a 15-minute break. Seriously, y'all, this is not the comedian talking, and we're going to be back, and we're going to have some fun. Somebody say amen. amen. Now, before we break up, you know, of course, nobody has to go anywhere. You can relax and chill, but we want to get Big Mama cake. We got Danielle's fish. We have a beautiful vendor that's selling some amazing T-shirt with, you know, Bible merchandise on it. I just bought one. Um, to say, I think it said Jesus did it. If Jesus done anything for you, raise your hands. You need to get a Jesus did it. Because you know what Jesus did for me? I just had my special that we're taping a comedy documentary on Amazon Prime. I did my very first special headlining at the historic, legendary Paramount Theater. Come on, give God a hand praise. I had 2,000 people in the house. Jesus did it. That's the same theater Tyler Perry go to. Jamie Foxx. Chris Tucker was there the weekend before me. I had 2,000 people at the Paramount Theater tape for my Amazon Prime special. Somebody said, Jesus did it. And you like, Shay, I didn't even know about it. I would have been, who was there? Raise your hand. See what I'm saying? We had a few out here. Everybody else was from Richmond. We had security. Listen. But Oakland, Richmond, Berkeley, San Francisco, Hayward, San Leandro, Antioch, Pittsburgh, Fairfield, they was in that thing. So I need y'all, Stockton, Next year, it's going to be Hoodish and Holy Comedy Tour Part. Who's coming to Part 2? Make some noise. Come on. I'm going to be here. Y'all, it was crazy. We didn't do the Montgomery Brawl skit. We did Lake Merritt Brawl. Listen to me. We had the white chair. It was... Y'all know my mind. I got a Hoodish and Holy Comedy mind. So we had skits. I had stand-up. I did something called the Hoodish and Holy Karaoke. We played Hoodish and Holy Family Feud. Y'all going to have to get your ticket next year. It's called, everybody say, Hoodish and Holy Comedy Tour. But next year at the Paramount, it's going to be part what? And part two going to be bigger and better. Baby, it's going to be crazy. Do you hear me, Uncle Ben? When I tell you this thing is going to blow people away, I'm telling y'all, you better get your ticket. Somebody say, Amen. Listen, uh, right now, we have about maybe, what, 12 more minutes in a mission? And then we're going to move on, and, and of course, we're going to enjoy Uncle John. But I need you guys to go ahead and see the vendors. We got fish, we got Big Mama's Cakes, and we also have a T-shirt vendor that has Jesus merch on it. So we'll be back in a few minutes. We're going to play some music, and we'll be back. Somebody say amen. amen. All right, here we go.
check, check.
One, two, one, two. Now, God bless you, God bless you, God bless you. Y'all know, maybe in a Baptist church, but we a little cozy apostolic in here, so you can't bring no food and eat in the sanctuary. Now, if you got a pie and you slid it under your, under your, under your chair, and I, I, I promise you, maybe in a Baptist church you can get away with that. But, but, but you know, maybe. But in uh, Greater Christ Temple, please don't eat no food in the sanctuary. Please don't eat Bishop T.D. will bust through that wall. 
He don't want no eating in the sanctuary. Chew your double man. Chew your juicy fruit. But don't eat mama cakes or Danielle's fish in the sanctuary. And if you can, if you need to, you got enough time to take your pies to the car so you won't be tempted to eat it. Please do not open, do not eat, do not do anything with food in this sanctuary. Somebody say amen. amen. All right. Amen again, whatever that was. Oh, yeah, we about to get started, y'all, real soon. Everybody's coming together. But thank y'all. I make it real, you know, sweet and tasteful, but I want to say thank you guys for listening and obeying instructions. Clap it up for yourselves. Amen. I always want to do everything in love, but we also got to do everything in decent and in what? And in order. Amen. So please, no eating, no drinking. This beautiful sanctuary, this carpet, those beautiful royal purple seats. We don't want no stains on them. We already got to deal with the little kids, so we don't want nothing else in this beautiful sanctuary. Somebody say amen. amen. All right, so that's that. Hey, come here, man. Your shirt. Come here, come here, come here. While we still bringing in intermission. I love your T-shirt. Y'all, what does this T-shirt say? Say it again, y'all. Your beard is holy. You better come on, Samson. Come on. What in the Samson anointing? Don't you let her touch your hair. Do you hear me? Come on. It's, you keep it. Yeah. And just add a little bit of blue magic grease. Amen. You, you, and you be good. I'm talking, boy, you're talking about power. You have power. Wonder, wonder work in power. Blue magic grease. Thank me later. Go to Sally's. Go to Sally's. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, y'all, we getting it together. So if, if we could bring the music down a little bit, let's bring it down a little bit. Let the people congregate, you know, what, what's the word? Congregate, what we supposed to say? Conversate? Congregate. What, I know how to say it. I went to Oakland Public School. How you say it again? Congregate. Let the people congregate. Man, all right. You can turn it up a little, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit. Not all the way. We just don't want the music too heavy on mother's ears. I know it's mothers in here. They don't like all that loud. I'm already loud enough. They probably like, he's so loud. Oh, that boy loud. Okay. People coming in. Okay. As, as people coming in, things are getting together. Um, clap it up for the band one more time. That's a bad band. Come on, y'all. Clap it up for the band. Come on, y'all. Um, let's do some shout outs. Um, I know we in Stockton, and so I'm gonna work my way that way. Y'all know when you from Oakland, that's the first thing you wanna come out your mouth. You know, we some proud Oaklanders. The town, the town. It ain't all about us. So let me go ahead. Let me go out. Let me see. Can I have you Sacramento? Is Sacramento in the house? Come on, Sack Town. Sack down and back down. Oh, that's what Tupac said. Sack town and back down. Or was that Dr. Dre? One of them said that. Elk Grove. Oh, come on, Elk Grove. Come on, Bougie. All right. That's like when I say Oakland, somebody say Emeryville. Concord. Because, see, I don't witness everywhere. My pastor would be like, come on, we going to Richmond. I say, no, that's not my ministry. Richmond is not my ministry. I will. I will go to Orenda. Amen. I will witness in Tracy, but I don't go to West Oakland, North Oakland, East Oakland. That's somebody else's ministry. I'm just playing. Y'all, I go to the hood, but I am hood-ish. Everybody say hood-ish. I ain't hood. I'm hood-ish. I mean, I act like I want to go to jail, but I don't. Amen. I really don't want to go to jail. I'm hood-ish, mother-ish. Leave that I-S-H on the end. All right, also, let's see here. Uh, you know what, let's see, maybe somebody came out the way or maybe from there, Fresno? No Fresno? Modesto. Okay, Modesto. Now, my, now my, my cousin moved to something called Rippin'. 
Ripping, no ripping. That's just where people live. Oh, look, look, we got one ripping. EPA in the house. Clap it up for East Palo Alto. Come on. We know what y'all used to be known for, but we ain't gonna say that. Listen, y'all was on the news. Listen, people know what you was known for. It's called, and the word capital was in there. Mm -hmm, capital was in there, but I ain't gonna say it. I ain't gonna speak that over your city. Listen, oh, Deshaun, stop moving. Oh. Let's see, uh, let's work our way. Tracy, Tracy, okay, that's where you stop and use the bathroom, amen. Nice. Nice, nice. Uh, let's keep moving. Um, Livermore, Pleasanton, no black people there, okay. All right, we just go to Stone Ridge. Huh? I might as well say Cheesecake Factory. That's, that's all we go there for. Okay, we're moving on, we're moving on. What are we, what are we hitting about, Castro Valley? We're at Castro Valley, Castro Valley. Okay, okay, nobody's on the boulevard, all right. Uh-huh, we're gonna keep it moving. Uh, what are we getting into now? We're getting to what, Hayward? No Hayward? I know some of y'all that moved out here. We ain't got no, no people that just relocated, no Hayward. Okay, uh, uh, San Leandro. Nobody went to San Leandro High, nobody. Oh, we got one, two, I, okay. Okay, look at San Leandro, you better be proud, pirates. <laughs> Uh-huh, uh-huh. Let's see, um, who I know if we only had one San Leandro, we know nobody here from San Lorenzo. I know that. Only thing we know about San Lorenzo is that Black Angus, baby. That's it. Black Angus in San Lorenzo. We know that, huh? Okay, let's we'll move on. Oh, you know what? Let's go across the 880. Uh-uh, Fremont, Newark. Uh-oh, we got one. Okay, come on. We got one. This room at the cross. Amen. Fremont, Newark. What is that other city over there? Union City, uh, that's, a, that's where Logan is. Union City? What about San Jose? Look, I see, oh! I I'm gonna hit one on the head. Make some noise for San Jose, come on now. Uh-huh, when I was back in my hoodish days, they had a club called the Beehive. Let nobody, don't, 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 don't tell nobody, don't tell nobody. That was the closest thing y'all had to Sweet Jimmy's. We ain't got to my city yet, we ain't got to my city yet. Uh-huh, let's work back down, 880. Uh-huh, we went to go too far, you're gonna get lost in the water. I don't wanna go to Redwood City. You know. We ain't gotta go to Pacifica. But you know what, since we are on one-on-one, -on -one, San Francisco, come on, San Francisco. Heart of HP, come on. Hunters Point, Filmo, Bayview. Don't ever go to them places. It's more than Pier 39 in San Francisco. <laughs> yeah, don't go to them places I just named. All right, um, let me see. Okay, San Francisco, we coming. Nobody from Treasure Island? Nobody, no, okay, no. I just figured somebody was from there. Ah, uh, uh, okay, okay, uh-oh, uh -oh, uh -oh, uh -oh. we crossing that bridge. Oh, we crossing that bridge. Can I get uh, just one, two, or three people from Oakland, California, in the building. You already know what we do. You better come on. Watch your purse. They they don't think they Richmond, but they they is. Oakland, little bougie, but they Richmond too. Good, I love it. All right, okay, let's go ahead. We can. I got the signal, but let's see. Vallejo in the house. Uh-huh, we know we got Richmond. You know I love you, Richmond. I'm just messing with you. Richmond in the house? Come on, Richmond. Uh, uh, then uh, Berkeley, Berkeley. Okay. San Diego, come on, sit down. All right, here we go. We about to get this thing started. That's my big, big bro, and, it, and we ready. Somebody say, we ready. Somebody say, J-Red. J-Red. We are Ready. Ready. Give me two minutes. Play some music. Two minutes. Play some music real quick. Praise the Lord, everybody. We're so excited to be here with you tonight. Listen, we want to share with you some of the oldies but goodies in the John P. Key catalog. We pray that this in the John P. Key catalog. We pray that this will be a worship experience that you will never, ever, ever forget. And before we come out, let me say... 
Thank you for supporting me for over 44 years. Give yourselves a hand. All right, all right. Everybody stand to your feet. Listen, because this is oh, a live he, recording, oh, never mind. that you put your phones away and totally enjoy and engage in this service tonight. If you see a camera near your face, start singing, even if you don't know the words. Make up some. Listen, I just want to get that beautiful smile on camera. Now, before we start, do me a favor. Please shout out your favorite John B. Key song. Shout it out right now. Okay, he's he's prepping y'all. Stand to your feet. 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 All right, now we get it ready. I need Stockton, California, greatest Christ temple, all over the Bay Area and beyond. We need to go ahead and get that mad hoodish and holy. Energy, vibe, and love. Put your hands together long and strong, loud and proud. Show love for your uncle, Pastor John P. Key. Make some noise!
I'm going to take you back to Atlanta. 27 years ago. In him. For a
Sit down in here. Oh, that noise. I'm so happy to be back here tonight. They had me confused for about four or five months. I was here one time and they were celebrating, I think, pastors and we got up after they finished a lot of their celebration. And we were singing, we were having a great time and then I got a note that said we had to vacate the building. So I thought we had been in there too long. I know my part wasn't long. Yeah, but we had a problem because after they put me out, I was outside by the bus and the bishop, who's going on to be with the Lord now, rolled out in his wheelchair and we sat out and talked under the tree for two hours. And I said, what happened? They said, he said, if it, if it was left up to me, we'd still be in there. So we try to tell promoters, don't tell lies. <laughs> Y'all can look shocked. I ain't shocked. I tell the truth. So let me tell you why I have no filter. As a pastor... And there's nothing wrong with this. You take care of your ministry gift. It's biblical. But I have never had to take one dime for the spoken word. Let me try it again. In other words, I don't take a salary from a church. I pastor one of the largest churches in Charlotte. And I'm a giver. I'm a serial sower. Yeah, yeah. It's, and look like if you had said that in the presence of saints, somebody would have said amen. But I understand. I'm a serial sower. Last night I was able to bless so many people from this area. And uh, I plan on doing it again tonight. Thank you for loving on us for 40 plus years. Clap your hands. California has been so good to me. I know. I'm known as a man from back east. I was born in Durham, North Carolina, outside the county line. Uh, but I spent a lot of my early years here. At age 14, I graduated from North Carolina School of the Arts. And they shipped me to Marysville School of Music, which was on the Yuba, in Yuba City. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I played for a church, and we're going to find out because I, 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 uh, it's still there. I played at 14 years old for Mount Olivet Baptist Church. Stop playing. Don't act like you went to that church. I'll pay your mortgage. I played with Donald Byrd and the Blackbirds. I was Phyllis Hyman's music director, 15 years old, playing in the NCO clubs on Beale Air Force Base. I did the first Peter Frampton tour from Winston to California. So I was here for uh, about four or five years. I started working with Miss Black Universe pageants. I was teaching um, the voices before they would go out and perform. Went back to Carolina to Charlotte and they stopped having the pageants. I didn't have a job making that nice money. Uh, I then in the neighborhood became a local uh, pharmacist. Yeah, I was a drug dealer in an area called Double Oaks. Many preachers don't tell this part of their testimony, but I got to tell it because that's where God saved me on the street. Amen, amen. He saved me on the street corner. After he saved me, I went back after I had a little prominence and made a few dollars, and I purchased the neighborhood that I sold dope in. Isn't that cool? Can't nobody do that but God. So I literally, thank you, pastor where I poison. That's what I tell people. I pastor where I poison. We created several ministries, 67 to be exact, outreach, and we took that neighborhood back. To date, I don't care what you read or what you see, I've taken more guns off the street than any police department in America. Yeah! You got to come see me. But we love you tonight, and we came just to bless God. Got all our talking out of the way. Because I'm going to sing all these songs that y'all been listening to and loving for years. Where's Mama, the lady that made us the cake uh, before we pulled out the last time? That's you, isn't it? Hey, there. 
you been baking lately? Thank you so much for loving on us. We appreciate it so much. First song I'm going to sing is a song to encourage everybody that went through the pandemic, didn't understand what it was, lost friends, family, job opportunities, everything. I got a song I wrote when I was about mm, 1920. I wrote it for the late great Reverend James Cleveland. I recorded it with the late great pastor Daryl Coley. It was Daryl that got my cassette. Y'all don't even know what that is. <laughs> Brought it out to Northern California. Uh, um, Uncle Ed heard it, and then I began to write for people like um, everybody. Thomas Whitfield working with Vanessa Bell Armstrong. So this is an old song. Ben, hey, don't mess me up tonight. I got all your checks in my pocket. And we're going to sound like we did back then. Now, I can sound like I did when I was 19. Y'all got to play. Like, I don't want a lot of bumbly bumbly. I want church music. Here we go. Give me a little turn my piano up like loud as they were. Turn me up. There it is. Thank you. My life is in. My life is in. Whoa. My life is in. Derek Cole taught us how to say, God. Yeah. We, made it. we made it through hard trials. Through hard trials. Yeah, we made it. We made it. Often criticized. We never gave up. We never gave up. Anybody been lied on? For my life, oh my God, we may, we may, you are trying, say we may. was still alive, he said, we made it, we made it. hallelujah, <laughs> we made it, we made it, oh, we made it, we made it. Yeah. 
are good songs. About 10 of y'all are excited that you made it. Uh, look down your road, catch somebody's eye and say, I made it, I made it. Oh God. Thank you, God. Look at your neighbor. Say, neighbor, I don't need but about 12 seconds. And I'll show you how happy I am.
sit down. You don't know what I've been through in the last week. Yes! Yes! Thank you, Jesus. Tell the young worshipers, they've got a new saying now. They say it's not worship, it's called, it's called um, the culture. And what's the other word they say? Um, yeah, the movement, the culture. And the devil is a lie. <laughs> Who are you to tell me? That my grandma wasn't worshiping at 3 o'clock in the morning. Just because she was not singing your confused songs. I submit to you that grandma was worshiping God. Grandma sung some songs that made it. They may didn't make it all the way to California. Grandma sung songs like this here. I need the old. I need the every. I need thee. Oh, I bless 
Bless me now, my Savior, Savior. I, 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 I come to thee. Grandma had some good. It was there by faith. I received my, 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 my son. And now I am happy. Oh, all the day. This is my stone this is my song oh praising my same all the day the day day long I got one more I'm gonna leave y'all alone now you had to have the Holy Ghost to sing this next one. Grandma started it like this. She said, oh, glory, glory to his name, precious name, glory to his name. I was a grown man before I realized the significance and the strength of these next lyrics. There to my heart was the blood of my singing glory to him. Grandma would say, him name oh. yeah sit down in here don't tell me about no worship Apostle Edwards will tell y'all, Edwards will tell y'all, I was writing worship. Tell him, Cliff, I was writing worship 45 years ago when it was not popular in the church. I got some songs that about 35 of y'all know. Somebody said, well, Pastor Key, you just a bitter old man that dyed your beard the other day. You just an old man and you just mad at the kids. I ain't mad at the kids. My worship, my worship songs still work at my church. I got one that went like this. Statistics, that's a big word in North Carolina. Statistics. I'll give you the honor. I'll give you the praise. Ever and Ever, 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 ever. I'll lift up your name. One more time. I'll give you the honor. I'll give you the praise. Forever and ever. Now lift up your name. I'll lift up your name. I got another one. I want you to finish it. <laughs> keep on going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is one right here. Matter of fact, when you go on your Facebook page tonight, talk about this concert. Say, yeah, I went to the reunion and he sung all them hits when I was a little girl. This one right here says, stop telling people your business. That ain't what I named it. I should have named it back there a long time ago. It said this. 
Whatever your problem Wave it away Where my people at in here? Whatever your trouble is Wave it away John think he would say Give it to Jesus Give it to Jesus Ah, give it to Jesus Give it to Jesus My, my, my I wrote another one Yeah, yeah Y'all don't know I wrote this one right here. This is an old one. I wrote it for New Jerusalem Baptist Church Choir. Yeah, this is old right here. Everybody over 62 going to remember this one. Yeah, yeah. And I ain't but 61, so figure that out. This is old right here. And honestly, you didn't know I wrote it. I'm about to sing it now. I'm going to sing you a couple songs I wrote you didn't know. As I travel day to day Showing the love of Jesus in every way I want the Lord to be by my side And I want Him to be my God Makes no difference what others say or do Lord, I'm willing to follow you Lord, I want, Lord, I want you to show me the way Show me, show me, oh God. Show me the way, Lord. Show me, show me, show me the way, Lord. Show me, show me, show me the way, Lord. Oh Lord, 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 I told you all the old folk wouldn't remember that. First time you heard my voice, first time you heard my, my voice, it, it wasn't in the church. You was at home watching TV, and a commercial came on. And a little boy was in the truck with his granddaddy. And he said, hold up. And the granddaddy hit the brakes. They were going fishing, I believe. And he ran back back to the house and he got a card for his grandfather and you heard me sing this song right here that's why I'm giving you this hallmark and I hope that you will see what I'm really giving you is a part of me thank you Jesus they took thank you Jesus off of it So I wrote one song, and it got out in D.C., Maryland, and Virginia. Yeah, that I didn't write it, the DMV. It was a group of musicians talking too much. There's somebody in this area that talk too much. I ought to call his name. I ain't got nothing to lose. <laughs> nothing. Stop talking about stuff you don't know. We got business here in this city. You running your mouth like you operate my business. I knew you wasn't coming tonight. I knew you wasn't going to show up, but somebody probably got a phone on so you can hear me. Stop doing that. I always want to be so important. You live in San Jose, I think. Look at the saints. Like, no, don't do it. Hush your mouth. That's why folk get away with everything. I'm like an old bishop. I calls it out. I don't have no foolishness in my church at all. Let me tell y'all something. I have no foolishness in none. You come over there trying to act up, we get you out of there quick. They're robbing churches in Carolina and Georgia. They're going in church. Now, let me tell y'all something. I sinned a long time, but I promise I love God even in my sin. We smoking weed, we pass the church, we put it down. <clears throat> I did a quartet program a couple of Sundays ago 
in what city where we at? Augusta, Georgia. I couldn't believe some of the stuff I seen outside. What happened to reverencing and respecting God? I don't have that food. I begged them to come try to rob us. Yeah, please come in. It ain't going to go like you think. And they walk into church real loud. Break yourself. Get, when you do that, we're going to be like, what? And what I'm going to do, I shout, get low. When I tell the saints to get low, all the saints go to the left. They just go down like that. And they know to stay down there till I tell them to get back up. Let's practice now. Get low. Yeah, stay down there. Yeah, come, yeah. Yeah, gotta be, come on back up. But next time, stay down there till I tell you. Yeah. Yeah. Stay down right there and we're going to take care of it. And everybody's worried about the security team. Don't worry about the security team. Worry about them mothers that's sitting right over there on the left. All my mothers came out the hood and all of them. Pastors and you that are in security, detail at your churches. Take care of your church. Take care of your pastor. Amen. Right. Right. Had a lady in Sunday, a couple of Sundays ago, talking about, I'll kill everybody in here. Don't say that. Yeah. Don't speak that in here. And I love the pastor in LA. I won't mention his name, but to have a woman hit your wife in the face. Lord Jesus, that, wouldn't, that news wouldn't even got out the church. My wife, a little bitty woman, but she slept out the hood. Let me tell you something. We might not even have to handle it. She might only handle it herself. I got this. I'll do it. My wife from West Boulevard. Yeah. And D Rider. That's where she's from. She be throwing them little gang signs at home when we be at home. And she went our way. She'll holler, D Rider. I'm like, I don't care nothing about that right now. My wife got a pause that I cannot stand. I know it's God. She don't answer stuff right away. She'll think about it. Honey, can I have some water while you're in the kitchen? <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Honey, can I turn the TV to, to ESPN to check a score? Sure. But well, by the time you tell me, sure, the game gonna be off. <laughs> She's here tonight, and I love her so much. I'm just playing with the people because she's here. Stand up. She actually came out on tour for the first time, and I love her. <laughs> turn around and wave. Turn around and wave. D Rider. <laughs> they say I didn't write this song. I wrote it. They say Richard Smallwood wrote it. Richard didn't say it. They did. And I won't call the names of people that were in the conversation. Morgan Turner, <laughs> the bass player that used to work with us. Now, Morgan said, Pastor Key, I didn't say it. I was just sitting in there with them. I said, well, my daddy said, if you sit amongst they, you become they. Now, I'm from the country, dirt is sticks, rocks. All we played was with dirt, rock, sticks, and leaves. Dirt, rock, sticks, and leaves. Dirt, rock, sticks, and leaves. We didn't have toys. They put us out the house at 7 o'clock in the morning. You were able to come back in at 7.30 in the evening. We were dusty kids, 16 of us, 30 little kids. But I still wrote that nice song. That's not a light skin song. That's a dusty song. Say, so what song is it, Pastor Keith? Come in the house. Help me say it, somebody. Come in the house. Lord Jesus, you are welcome. Jesus, you are welcome. Oh, Come in the house. Let your glory Let feel. Let your glory feel. Glory fill, glory fill the house. Lord Jesus, you are welcome. Jesus, you are welcome. Jesus, 
Jesus, you are welcome. Jesus, you are welcome. Come on, come in the house. Come in the house. Come in the house. Come in the house. He's already here. Sing it with me. He's in the house. He in the house. He's in the house. He's in the house. He's in the house. If you know he's already here, open up your mouth and say, If you believe in God for something and your faith says it's already yours, say, He, come in the house. I like that song. I like that song. All right, something's getting ready to happen in here. For those that are over 45, let me reduce it, 42 and a half. I need y'all to help me. Now, Kirk Franklin and, and, and Travis Green and, 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 and Kalante and all them little kids, Yeah, they out here running around, jumping on speakers, going crazy. So I was sitting at home the other day. I said, you know what? We got a crew. We used to rock like that, too. So, uh, yeah, Ty Tribbett, uh, uh, what's the other one name? Chandler Mora. All of them. And I raised all of them. I did. Ty came out of VIP. James Fortune came out of VIP. Stop playing. So we that are over 41 and a half, I reduced it again. <laughs> I need y'all to do me a favor. What we're going to do is we're going to get up and show these kids how we used to really worship God. Now look at me. Back in the day, it was John, it was John P. Key in New Life and Milton Brunson in the Thompson Community Choir. We travel together. We wasn't mad at who went last, who headlined, we didn't care. I remember Cobo Hall, what we'd do at the end of the concert, we would combine two of our songs. We gotta go back and combine two more. God, my what's the other one we used to sing? Um, I can do all things. Don't worry about it, I'll figure it out. And we're gonna combine some more. But these two, we would do one of theirs and one out, and we'd do it with the same beat, and we would rock the church. So what I need is, for not all of y'all, because some of y'all ain't took your medicine yet. Y'all know we have to take our medicine by 6.30. And we laughed at all the seniors. I remember my grandma used to be on the phone with her sister, and she'd say, you took your Gabby Penton? I don't even know what that is. And then the other sister say, you took your Kumala? <laughs> now I done turned to that age. So over 42, now I'm talking about, I need you to go back in time in your mind when your hairline was closer to your eyebrow. <laughs> Men don't laugh when you had a girl named Jerry. <laughs> we about to rock this. We about to shake these lights in here. You that are under 40, just sit there and watch us. Now I need a few witnesses over 42 and a half to jump up with me now. Let's show these kids how we used to do it. Don't be ashamed. I know you know the song. Come on up. We're going to do Chicago first or we're going to do North Carolina first? What you say, Slim? We're going to do Chicago first. Come on, put your hands together. Start 
Oh, 
down before I start doing it again. Watch it, dude, watch it. your hands if you love God. Sit down. We got to move fast. Come on. I got to go fishing. Amen. For those that have dealt with depression, oppression, anxiety. I'm your pastor. The young man that's carrying the bass, is he the bass player? Is that your father that's the bass player? You his uncle. Come here, young man that's carrying the bass. Come here, come here, come here. Hurry up, come here. He said, thank you. So I'm going to multiply the blessing. God is miracle, not by plan, but by being a steward. Come on, sometimes you're going to have to help somebody first. I love God. I love him so much. 
So I wrote a song for, we're going to get out here about to sing some good old church songs in a minute. Um, I wrote a song for, what's her name? Tasha Cobbs. Tasha Cobbs Leonard. And then we start singing it on the tour, so I took it back. <laughs> but then here comes the pandemic. Nobody was really traveling, so we got together and we did it together. I want to sing a little bit of it just to a hair because I want you to know that if you're going through depression, I know a God that can handle that. Hit the words, hit the words. I'm going to sing just a little bit of it. Even if your heart is breaking, been forsaken, God is waiting for you. Even if you're falling in sin, no, you will win. God is waiting for you, for you. For you, for you, I really like what you done for me. I can't really explain it. I'm so into you. I'm in love. All the great things you've done for me, Jesus. I can't explain it. I'm so into you. You don't hear me say, I, you've been good. You've been good to me. Oh, that was a little slow say. You've been That one was a little loud, say. You've been good to me. If the Lord's been good, do you hear me say, y'all? You've been good to me. Oh, 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 yeah. You've been good. You've been good to me. DJ Rogers would say, oh, no. Hey, hey, hey. You've been good to me. One more time, yeah. good to me. Then Tasha comes in, she says, I hear the voice of God telling me I will no longer be broken. And John P. Key comes in, he says, I in my heart and my soul. Knowing one day I will be like him, like him. And then Tasha says, You shall let this mind be. You shall let this mind, John Bicky said, Me be. Then Tasha said, You shall let the smile be in you that was in Jesus. Hey, put me back together. Put me back. Put me back together. Put me back together. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I've been broken Put too me long. This song is for you that have gone through something. Put me, Put me back together.
Break it down. Before I go this evening, I need about 35 or 40 witnesses that went through in the last four years and God, God put you back together again. Where my 40 at? Stand up and sing it with us. Put me back. Put me back together. Yeah. Put me back together. My, 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 my. Put me back together. Okay. Oh, oh, yeah. Break it down. Elder in the back, I need your help. I came all the way to California. Yeah, you. I need somebody in here that can really sing. I don't need nobody starting out. Bring me somebody that can really sing in here. Let them sing this song with us. Find me somebody. Go get them. Don't beg them. If they say not them, God doesn't want them to sing a note in this house. Bring me somebody that love God and you ain't got to beg them. Bring him. I hope you got the right person, J. Red. Let him start. Let him start. You come on, start, Lord. Yeah. Put me back together. Put me back together. Lord, I need you to put me back together. Put me back together. When I look over my life. Hallelujah. Put me back together. Where you brought me from, God, I want to say, put me back together again. Oh, put me, put me back together.
my God. That was amazing. My, 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 my. Nothing you can say. That's when you know it's God. Help me say, God put me back together. God put me back together. God did it. God put me back together. God did it. God put me back together. Wow. Listen, I don't I don't pedal. My nephew will tell you I don't pedal my music ever. But that one song, if you've got a relative or a family member that's dealing with with depression you get that song tonight Hallelujah. grab that song tonight it's me and, and Tasha and I can't tell you Tasha did what she did but get that song tonight and share it amen, amen. I'm blessed by it yes. you. amen you get it I get it a bit get it get that song everything about this tour has been an act of faith we started out in Carolina we went to New Orleans, bus two, um, airbags on the bus, not one, both of them. Thursday night, I was still in Mississippi. And in 24 hours, I went from, what part of Mississippi? Help me. Gulfport. Gulfport, Mississippi, to Rancho Cucamonga, California. I was in concert. So God is amazing and we got more cities to go. We're in Vegas for two days. Then we're in DeSoto, uh, Texas. We're in Waco the next night. We're in Houston recording live with the old crew, Nene, Lowell. We're all coming back to do it in Houston. Then we're in the great city of Atlanta, Georgia, recording live again. We go home. Then we're in Indianapolis, Detroit, Michigan. Sandusky. Sandusky. Ohio. Washington, D.C., Baltimore. We're going to be rolling for a while, so keep us in your prayers. Amen. Make sure you grab a music fan. Get my fans. My fans fan better than all these little fans y'all got. I left my corners. I give you all the air. Make sure you get the fan. We've got music out there for everybody. Maybe just say, look, Miss Jeanette, I'll give you $100. Just give me everything you got. Be a blessing. These young people are amazing, and I'm so excited. And all of them can sing, all of them. I'll let them sing something before we walk off this next song. This is what we're going to do. Uh, let me say, too. Where's she at? Lane, where are you? There she is. Why are you in the back? She did an excellent job. Give her a hand. And her business partner. You from Gastonia? The gas house, I used to sell drugs up there. He know when I called it the gas house, he tried to duck his head down. That's a, I love you so much. Thank you, too, for stepping out on faith. Thank you for all of the haters and the naysayers that said you wouldn't do this. Amen. They encourage you to do it. Amen. Bless you. All right, this is what we're going to do. And they got us, let me tell you something, I don't even know the name of this hotel they got us staying in. I ain't never heard of it. I went up in my room. Me and my wife might be moving to the city. Is it? They got blue carpet in there. and I was on one side, and then my son told me, he said, Daddy, that, I said, that's our side too? What you talking about? We might be late to Vegas. The accommodations are amazing. Thank you. We love you for it. Because I've been brought to this area before and put in hotels that I couldn't even tell nobody. Don't push me. 
Because I will tell it. Thank you for loving on us. Tonight, listen to me clearly. We want you to grab all the music you can. They got the, the credit card machine out there. They got the cash app, all of that. Just make sure you get something to support Uncle John. All right, I'm going to take you back now. I'm going to take the carpet up real quick, and I'll put it down when I'm finished. Hit, um, hit, uh, let me hit, a, let me hit a, the, the floor. Oh, that's too weak. Ooh, there it is. Where he at? Stop playing with me. Uh, let me hear Fred Hammond and make sure. Let me hear Fred Hammond. Uh-huh, you heard me ask for it. That's what I want to hear. Then I'll know if it's up here. Y'all can't do that for me tonight? Say bless, say bless, say bless. I don't need to hear him no more. Don't play, though. Let's take him to the... Wait a minute. All y'all over 60 years old, get ready. Let's show these kids how we really used to have church. Hit it. Oh, I'm a mansion now. Oh, I feel it. 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 Mansion now. I feel it. I believe it. Oh, it. Oh, it. I believe it. Oh, it. I it. I believe it. In the valley, found it to be bright. Bright as the morning star. In the valley, bright as the morning star. In the valley, bright as the morning star. Somebody found deliverance in the valley. Out of the valley. Yeah. Out of the valley. Oh, Lord. Out of the valley. Keep it gangster. Out of the valley. Help yeah. Yeah. 
There's a lady back there still clapping by right now. Still clapping right here. Keep it up. Put your hands together. Break it down, brother. Break it way down this evening. When I was a little boy on Sunday evening, they'd go out on the porch with the amplifiers and a kick drum and a snare. And I had an uncle named Uncle Book. Uncle Book had one long leg and a short leg. But he could play that guitar and he played like this right here. I want to show you how Uncle Book used to play that guitar. Leland, play like a book. Turn him up in the house. My grandmama would walk out on the porch and my grandma could rewrite anybody's song. My grandma would come out there and say something like this. She said, I'm gonna cry my hand. Y'all sing like grandma. She said, I'm gonna cry my hand. Said again with me, say, I'm gonna play my hands. And if we wasn't paying no attention, she said higher like this. She said, I'm gonna play my hands. And then Book would start playing again, and Grandma would clap. Doctor, stop playing with me. Christ, you don't know nothing about that right there. I'm gonna clap. One more time, say.
Sit down. You ain't clapped that much in 20 years. Sit down. Rest. When you get back up, we're leaving here. I ain't singing that no more. Sit down. Cliff, they hired me. They hired me to record a song for one of your buddies. Now, I didn't mean to stop you, but you mentioned his name in the back. Y'all reconnected. So I'm going to give him a little history. They hired me to write a song for him, and I, I was obedient. But when I wrote the song and I heard it, I knew that song wasn't going to New York. I took that song back. <laughs> he called me in three years and asked me to record a song with him, so I did that. It's the highest song I ever sang in my life. If you Google it when you get in the car, you'll say, I can't believe Uncle John was singing that high. Well, I sang that high because he told me, well, I didn't think you could do it anyway. You don't tell nobody from Durham you can't do nothing. I got some hot water and some aspirin, and I went in the studio that morning, and I recorded a duet with him, and it's so crazy. In one of the hotels a few days ago, they had the digital gospel radio, and it came on, and I just smiled in my room. I couldn't believe 37 years ago we recorded. Now, statistics say at least... 35, 45 of y'all know this song. Give me the loop, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> Everything's gonna be Come on. Think I'll make it. Give me up. Oh, I know. Think I'll make it. Give me up. Now clap like you're from New York. Pause. Pause. I'll make it. I'll make it. I will. I'll make it. I'll make it. I'll make it. I will. I'll make it. Sing God's word. I'll make it. I rely on him. I'll make it. Yeah. I'll make it. Do you hear what you're saying? Do my trials. Do my pain. You better be. Everything's gonna be all right now. Baby, get Kevin, your brother. Listen, now I'm gonna sing the song that I I stole from him. I took it back. I wrote it. Everybody sung it. Your grandma sung it. You sing your choir. Young Adult Choir, the Mass Choir, the Shout Band, all of them sung it. The Little Kids Choir, the Tamarine Children, Tots Choir, Sunshine Band, yeah, Happy Kids, Little Children, Little Devil, whatever y'all call them kids. They sung this song right here. In the movie I did for my father. Mahalia Jackson sings it in 1957. The problem with that was I wasn't born to 62. I ain't gonna make you wait another second. Here it is. Sometimes feeling low, and nowhere 
it comes along and it makes me real strong.
Baptist. The Baptist version. Baptist. Sure. Won't it do it? Won't it will? The Lord will. Can I get a witness? Sanctified witness. He will. Good God about it. God of mercy. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Somebody help me say this tonight. Say, you don't know my story. You don't know my story. Look down your row and tell somebody, say, you don't know my story. You don't know my story. Let's let them know a little bit about your story. Say, I'm blessed. I'm blessed. What a blessed people in the room. Even if you don't sing, wave at Uncle John and just say it with your mouth. Say, I'm blessed. I'm blessed. Let's sing this and go home. What's that say? I am blessed and I know I am. I am blessed and I know I am. A little lighter, say. I am blessed and I know I am. I am blessed and I know I am. Say, I am blessed and I know I am. I am blessed and I know I am. Let me hear you a little louder over there. I am blessed and I know I am. I am blessed and I know I am. And I know I am. I know I am. No way. Just throw your hands up like this. Am I delivered, folk? I'm leaving here. Say it again. I'm delivered. I'm delivered. <laughs> say it, say it, I'm delivered. I'm delivered. Oh, 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 yes. I'm delivered. I'm delivered. Hear my story. Hear my story. God bless you. I love you with my heart. Production staff, is there a pastor here that can come and represent this area and just pray God's blessing? I won't beg long because I know how to pray. Amen. Come on up here. Amen. Pastor here. Amen. As he's coming up and preparing, listen to me clearly. Whatever you're going through, by faith, I believe God can fix it. Get him a microphone, y'all. Get him a mic. It's an extra mic down there. I want you to know God can fix it. John P. Key wrote a song about 40 years ago, 38 to be exact. And... Um, Statistics say 90% of you know it. I'm going to share just a little bit and he's going to pray. And we're going to sing I Made It Out. Young people, y'all going to come over here and sing it with me. We're going to be right at the front of the stage. Because that's our new anthem. Whatever you're going through, God can bring you out. I wrote a song on my church choir's new record that's coming out probably first quarter. It says, God can do it, pull you through it. In God's own time, give me what's mine. I need you to clap like it's already yours. Walk up with an attitude, please. It's me. It's me, oh Lord, I'm standing. I am standing in for me. Yeah. Now my mother, my mother, father, father, sister, or brother. 
the song that said new life new life new life oh, new life he's given us he has given us brand new life Tonight, whatever you need from God by your faith. Listen, I don't care if it's a new job, a new position, a new house, a new car, whatever you need God to do. I want your faith to get in front of your face. And meet me at this altar right now. I dare you. Come on. Nobody's going to tug you, pull you. Come on to this altar like Pastor Key. I need him tonight. I ain't even past the key tonight. Uncle John, I need God to move in my heart. Move in my life. Come on to the front. Come on down here. Come on in here with me. Come on, family. You young people, I want you to come as a sign that all young people are not going to hell. There's some folk that really love God. Come on up here with Uncle John. Come on. Yeah. yeah oh. I need a few more of you young people at the altar with me. Come on, come on, come on, hang out with me. New life, new life, giving up. He has given us brand new life. New life. We're going to say it one more time and my brother's going to pray. New life. New life. Oh, oh, oh. New life. Oh. Brand new life, life. Oh, oh, oh. He has given us new life. New life. As every head bowed and every eyes closed, yeah. the Bible said in the Romans 10 and 13 that if thou shalt call upon the name of the Lord, thou shalt be saved. My brothers and sisters, my dears and sirs, there is an opportunity. You don't have to run up and down the aisles. You don't have to roll on the floor. But if you just confess your sin, God said, I'm faithful and I'm just to forgive you of all of your sins. Amen. The pastor just got through singing a song, New Life. You can have new life right now. Just open your mouth and say, Dear Jesus, come into my heart and forgive me of all of my sins. I believe you died for my sins and I believe that on the third day God raised you from the dead 
Now, Lord, I'm going to be honest with you. I can't do it by myself. But with your help, I'm willing to serve you all the days of my life. Father, in the name of Jesus, God, you know what we're going through. We may be looking good on the inside, but our hearts are heavy. We may be looking good on the outside, but tears falling from our eyes. God, we don't know. You know what's going on when we all by ourselves. But if we call on your name, God, you said if we just have the faith of a grain of a mustard seed, we can speak to that mountain and declare a mountain be removed and cast into the sea. So whatever you're going through, I speak to that mountain right now. In the mighty name of Jesus. How many know there's power in the name of Jesus? There's healing in the name of Jesus. There's deliverance in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and say, Jesus, I need you now. Now, Lord, I pray that you be glorified. I pray that that nasty, stinking devil be terrified. And when we leave here, we will be edified. And we will give your name the praise and glory and all the honor. If you would just open your mouth and tell the Lord, thank you. Come on and tell him, thank you. Come on and tell him, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. He has given us Up your hands, young people. Get to the dance floor. Y'all, do me a favor. Please don't leave. Be a blessing to us tonight. We need you. If John P. Key's music has touched your heart anywhere, anywhere. Amen. Do us a great favor tonight and grab something before you leave to share, even with somebody else. Young people, let's get to the dance floor. We're going to start in North Carolina. We're going to D.C. And then we're going to Louisiana. Let's make it happen. Come to the floor. Uh. DC, come on!
Uncle John P. Somebody say, Jesus. I want to do this fast. Hold on, hold on, hold on. They want y'all to hear this. Y'all know the Moonies work very hard. Let's get them their clothes. Somebody say, amen. amen. Clap it up for Moonies production. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I need y'all to just stand still for two minutes, two minutes. Thank you, Bishop and First Lady Dockery, to all the bishops and pastors as well, everyone that gave their last to help us. Uh, clap it up to Pastor John Harris. Uh, Jonathan Johnson, come on y'all, Pastor James Williams, Apostle Garrison, Huey and Sister Quincy in the GMWA Unity Choir, Beware Productions and the entire Mooney Productions band. Clap it up for that band, y'all, and clap it up for the Mooney's band. Mama Gail, you know we love you. Lady Dockery, Bishop Dockery, Devin Watkins, come on y'all. Deacon Larry Banks um, to all the Moon Tribe, meaning everyone that supports us. Danielle Banks over the food. Bless, uh, bless Trends clothing line. We want to thank the cast. Now, this is the part. I need everybody to sit down real quick because these people have to stand up. Someone passed away that was very great that gave Elaine the opportunity to go to Women That Are Loose with Bishop T.D. Jakes. She was a part of that um, journey. And the play was called God's Trying to Tell You Something. The late, great, produced and directed by Auntie Delilah Williams. We would like the entire cast and the band of that play to stand up. She left a legacy. We're going to continue to live out her legacy. Give God a hand praise for the band and the cast of God's Trying to Tell You Something stage play directed and produced by the late, great Auntie Delilah Williams. Before we get out of here, everybody say, tonight was awesome. But y'all ain't ready for the future. If y'all understand, that's my favorite, Uncle John. But this ain't nothing to sneeze at. Because, baby, next year, 2024, we want to put it on your calendar now. In the summer of Saturday, June 22nd, Tasha Cobb Leonard. Make some noise! So we let y'all know in early bands. Somebody say early bands. Saturday, June 22nd, we want you guys to walk out with this on your mind. Mooney Production presents Tasha Cobbs Leonard. We're going to break every chain up in here. I'm talking about your watch, your wrist, everything. So I love you guys. Um, listen, stand back up. We out of here. We're going home. I know we acting like we Catholic, huh? Stand up. We're going home. So Tasha Cobbs Leonard, June 22nd next year. Uh, thank you, Bishop KT. Clap it up for Bishop KT Henderson. Amen. And uh, also, um, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We get this right. Let me get this right. We going home. Matthew Aguirre, Jerron Heim Jr., Sacramento Unity Choir, and of course, Bishop and Pastor Uncle John P. Key. Everybody say, Lord, I thank you for tonight. We thank you that the seed met the need. We edified your people.